It was the scariest day of my life. I just felt very uncomfortable, um, and I thought maybe this is part of the pregnancy. They told me that I had um, preeclampsia. Uh, my blood pressure was very, very high, over 200, and they had to deliver her really quick. And I kept telling them that she's not going to survive. She's only, I'm only 23 weeks. At 245 grams, there's reservations on survival. They told my husband that he had about an hour with her and that she was going to pass away. But that hour turned into two hours, which turned into a day, which turned into a week. Well, I'd heard about her. I'd heard that we had such a tiny baby and it sounded unbelievable because I mean, she's about half of the weight as a, a normal 23-weeker. So I went and saw her and just kind of, you could barely see her in the bed, she was so tiny. Um, so we do everything we know how to do as well as we can, and um, after that it's really up to our babies. Um, so some really had the strength to, to go through what they have to go through and grow outside the womb. Because <laughs> even when I'm not here, I think about her, like, how's she doing today, and that, so, yeah. She's uh, a miracle, that's for sure. Uh, we definitely get really invested in these primaries that we have. It's, it's kind of cool to follow them and see them get better if they're having an off day. We're like, eh, what's going on with you? So, we invest a lot into them, and we love it. <laughs> I just want to say, oh my God, I love Emma, Kim, Michelle, Devin. Oh, you know, all, we had so many nurses, but her primary nurses were just, they became friends. I, I don't want to cry. <sighs> Look at all those signs, they made it. You know, I would come in and then it's like, happy birthday, mom. It's just, I'm so grateful for them. I'm just really proud of them and the baby and to see, see I told you. <laughs> um, just like see them transform as parents and see this little baby go home that usually is like completely against all odds. Sharp Mary Birch is the best place I believe for micro preemies, our NICU has every modality, every piece of equipment, the technology, the staff, the physicians, the knowledge to take care of someone that's born at 23 plus three. So Sabi was the exact right spot, right time um, for this to happen. I am waiting for this day. I want to go. We want to go. We're not, if we go home today, I don't think we can forget the state. We should celebrate this date every mm -hmm. time, huh? It's going to be a special moment for us. I just wanted her to know how strong she is and how, I mean, if she can start off where she was and do as well as she can be, there's nothing she can't do. It was a beautiful experience. I love this hospital. Everybody, everybody from, I mean, the staff from the security guard, whenever I come in, how's your day? Sometimes you just want to hear somebody asking, how's your day? I mean, I, I, I feel blessed. I mean, she, she is the smallest baby, but she's mine.